what's up guys, Diplex here again, welcome back to Call to Arms, I hope you guys enjoyed my previous video, or so at least I think you guys did, I got a lot of positive feedback and some good comments, saying that you guys wanted to see some more Call to Arms, Sir Hinkle got in touch with me, he's the guy who makes a lot of the custom skirmishes for Men of War Assault Squad, and now of course Call to Arms, and I am excited to be bringing you one of his latest creations, Lost Bird. Now, this is also another Black Hawk Down scenario. Uh, I wasn't aware of this mission until he contacted me saying he saw my... Uh, wait, just look at this. That chopper just took off. How cool is that? All right, so we have a SEAL team that's been dropped off here. We're going to be uh, reaching the crash site and defending it together with the remaining survivors from the crash. Now, I wasn't aware of this mission until he contacted me saying that he had saw or seen my Black Hawk Down video. And... Uh, <laughs> I started playing this, I tried it out the other day, I didn't make a video of it, but I just went in to check it out and I came to realize that this mission really deserves that Black Hawk Down title over on my channel, but it's already occupied with a half shabby scenario that I made up in 10 minutes and this is something completely different. Uh, this is super cool, so let's just enjoy this, I think I've found and made up a decent title for this mission um, before uploading it anyway, so we'll see what that comes to be. Right, so we're in control of the SEAL team here, and we're heading to the crash site. It reminds me of Mogadishu in a way. Oh, that guy's got a grenade launcher there. We're gonna shoot that thing again at the technical, have it blow up. Takes a while to reload. There we go. Zoom. Ah, what an explosion. That's wonderful. Sick. Move it up. So this is like, we're SEAL team here. We are the SEAL team. But, uh, we're kind of like... Kind of like in the movie, we'd, we would be the Delta guys. And also in the movie, there was this like construction site around here. So it, the whole the whole area here where the Black Hawk went down kind of reminds me a lot of the Black Hawk down scenario from the movie. It's pretty cool. I quite like it. Moving up, let's go. So cool. I love it. All right, so we have that row of enemies sitting around back there. We're going to grab our grenade launcher again. We're going to swing away a grenade. Didn't kill anyone. Hmm. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, so we've cleared out this side. We can move up. Head to the center. That was a quick clean out. It's like one guy remaining. Well, we've reached the crash site. We've defended it with the, the remaining survivors. At least we've killed all the possible assailants. Well, we've got one more back here. Oh, I didn't know that ladder had, like, unique physics. That's so cool. There we go. Prepare to repel incoming militia assault. Secure the crash site to all directions. Ooh. Okay, boys. All right, they're going to be coming from all directions. We've got a couple of guidelines here that will help us uh, lock it down. So we've got guys coming in from here, we'll get, we'll assign a couple of people to each of these little open windows in here. There we go. I think we'll need an additional guy over here, so I'm just going to keep guy around the corner. Actually, I want the saw in a good stable position. We'll have the MP5K around the corner, that's a perfect little uh, reach around gun. Uh, there we go, get these guys around here. I'm not entirely sure what that meant. Uh, I'm gonna try and not overthink what I just said. Reach around gun. Uh, that's that's odd. <laughs> but if... <laughs> I meant like lean around the corner and shoot gun. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh Lord. Uh, anyway, we're in a pretty good spot now. These guys are gonna tighten in a bit. They're not gonna be out there. We're gonna have them come further in. Maybe have a guy there in that direction. Have a guy looking around the corner there. Get a guy behind this crate. That's perfect. Now we got this. Look, it's perfect. It's like a little hole. It's a whole circle in here in center. So we're ready to repel the incoming assault. We're going to... No, we can't speed up. I'm playing this in LAN. It's like in multiplayer. So I can like gift yes, units. Sir. Except there's no one else to gift them to. Um, it's because I got I to gotta play the previous scenario. Which I already did to unlock this one. So... Yeah. So quiet. You hear this? So silent. You can't even hear the wind. Who knows? Maybe there might might not be any wind, but yeah. 
All right, map extended a bit. We can see that there were probably oncoming waves from this direction as well. We have a militia wave coming in from here. <laughs> they walk in an interesting manner. They're very fast about it, but they're not really running. <laughs> it's uh, interesting. Cover a lot of ground, but just walking. And we're going to be opening up. Open up! Yeah, it was a good idea placing that machine gun by a wall like that, not having it lean around. Corner. Car incoming! Oh, we just messed that car up. Sweet. Love the AT4. That's sick. I'm gonna need to see how. Who's that guy? This guy? He's got a couple of rockets remaining. That's good for him. Oh, I want to throw a rocket that way, but there's a wall in the way. And there's no point. Oh, why'd you fire that? I didn't have, actually have him fire that. He threw. He, he used the weapon he had in his hand to shoot. He took down a bit of the building. That's so cool. I've never seen physics like this. That's sick. It just. It reminds me a lot of the Battlefield one. It's like not one set of the building collapsed. Like exactly where the rocket hit, it took it down. And I, I've got a feeling they've got some pretty fast physics on this engine by now. So that's that's super cool. This game just reminds me a lot of Battlefield in general. Just the way it, the way it highlights some of the graphics and physics. And just it's just like a like a Battlefield version of a uh, in an RTS in the RTS version in a way. I'm not sure if that made any sense. We got a lot of militia coming in. We have hundreds of militiamen coming to our position. How are we going to be able to hold this? A ranger squad approaching from the west or the east. Um, okay. While well, they're coming in. Rangers! Clear the way! I'm just going to gun those guys down there quickly. That was painful to watch. We're going to have him go in here, and then we're going to spread him out nicely. He's going to hit the deck over there. This guy's going to head up here. He's going to kind of go do a little reach around the corner kind of thing. This guy's going to go over there. There we go, all spread out nicely. Well, they're not really spread out that well, to be honest. They're kind of in a like, bunched up a bit, but it should work. It'll have to work. Put the guy behind the pillar up there. There we go, nice. We should be able to repel this attack without any problems. Three minutes to go. <laughs> One survivor. Unless you ran across the street, that's interesting. I don't like him having <laughs> being there. And go up and deal with them. Oh. Hit by the hell. Hit by the hell. There we go. Another car! Oh, he missed. I don't, I don't think he missed. Holy shit! That's an SPG. Taking that thing. It knocked away a couple of the boards from the building. Did you see that? It was crazy. It's absolutely crazy. That's that's what we do. That's how we do it. That's how we do it. Ooh, hit something else back there. <laughs> We're gonna keep this car, that's for sure. I'm not sure what we hit there. That was odd. We'll let him fire on his own. <laughs> it's fun. I'm going to enjoy this car. Quite like it. There we go. Oh, a lot of them hiding back there. Ah, love it. I'm absolutely loving it. I'm loving it. 
Okay, do we have any... No, we got like AP left. Dude, AP's gonna blow. Can't believe we're using AP to attack infantry. It's like we don't have any HE. Oh, that guy got hit in the ass. More troops coming in. This ought to be the last wave. Shoot a mass signal. Oh. No, hold down. It's burning as well. At least this corporal's alive. Get back in cover, boy. Twenty seconds. This is great. Captain, hold the marked position and wait for further orders. Okay. So now we gotta go and recounter and kind of, kind of like a stretch out and attack that position. All right, so what we'll do is we'll keep most of our guns in that direction over there. Then I'm going to get an attack squad, have them sent around the corner. Three more rangers who were cut off. Just, okay. Okay, so it's kind of like, it reminds me a bit of, of uh, Black Oak Down in a way, how there's like spread out squads all around the city. There aren't like any assets there to create like a perfect Somalian town like Mogadishu or something. I'm not sure that's a perfect town, but you know what I mean. It's probably not a perfect town in terms of <laughs> ruling and... You know, oh, we're gonna have a man down any second now. You better go behind cover and heal. There we go. We'll have those guys lined up over there. Then we'll grab our squad of elites. Have them sent up here. Moving out. It's like a SEAL team sergeant or something leading this team here. We've got pilots, a couple of rangers, some marines, probably too. Navy SEAL Ranger, Navy SEAL Ranger, Tank Commander. Hmm. Well, he's like the pilot in this case. The pilot has a weird uniform in the game right now. I don't know why. It looks odd. This guy and his MP5K are going to go around the corner. Covering fire! There we go. Pilot's down. That's not good. I do have medics around, I think. That guy's a medic. Moving up. Let's go. This guy's resorting to using his pistol. Is this easy out of ammo? He is. Tricky. Oh, that's so cool. Leaning on the corner. Took him out with a pistol. I love it. There we go. That's more like it. Shit. There we go. We're capping it now. 